How many people watching out there think your toenails look pretty good and you don't need to do much to them? Well, today I show you how much excess skin I clean out from underneath these pretty toes, so stay tuned. I'm Lori Halloway, known as the meticulous manicurist on YouTube and an expert in the field of nail technology, specializing in pedicures. Best way I could say that. Right. Yeah. Just, um... If you're new here, welcome! Please subscribe and click the bell to turn on your notifications to know when I upload my weekly video and be notified if your comment got the most likes and will be featured in an upcoming video. So it's been a while. Wow! <laughs> we sweep those up at the end. <laughs> Don't worry. None left behind. Huh? A really high hyponychium. I gotta make sure we don't miss that. I learned that we're watching our channel <laughs> to build a clientele and do the kind of services that I do, that I could just live vicariously through them and hopefully be able to pay my mortgage. I think you made this one. <laughs> yeah, it worked out. And then um, I invented a hand rest for nails and it saved my neck. So mm -hmm. I haven't had any issues. That's so awesome. <laughs> So I have not had to retire. I have so much gut. Oh yeah, your toes are gonna feel great. They can feel so tight mm -hmm. when you get all of this material compacted down in there. Sometimes it does feel You're so sweet. I remember those days. Mm. They're going by so fast. My boys are so big now. I, my 16 year old was in the kitchen the other day and I'm like, come here and give me a hug. He's like, what do you want? I go, I want you to act like you love me like you did when you were six. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want. It's just so much to love it. <laughs> <laughs> he wiped the uh, wax. I mean, out here. Oh, yeah. Do you have really long nail beds on? Sometimes he don't have to like sitting for the soap. So I'm like, okay, well. Right, take advantage of the time when you can. Take a little bit longer in the shower. It's really nice to do stuff for a guy. Is he tall? Mm -hmm. He's 6'3". Nice. He doesn't have any uh, rough calluses or anything. Yeah, no. This is pretty awesome, man. <laughs> Let's see if I can find a picture of him by himself.
he was insulting me and I was just like, you know what? That that was unnecessary. And it was out in front of everyone. Everyone kind of saw what she did. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, and so then after what I was, I was a um, housekeeping inspector. And I went from being that to being working in the laundry room. And I stayed in the laundry room and my hours went from 20 to 15 to 12 to 10. Oh my gosh. Yep. And so I just, I just quit. I said, you know, you can have it. Yeah. I, I lost everything pretty much except my car. Oh, that's sad. Not really. It's a blessing in disguise, you know. Well, it didn't sound very fun. No, no. And I was pregnant through it all. You know, I can only imagine if I could go and stick it on my husband. So it was kind of sad. anything for granted. I think mm -hmm. for all the little blessings. For sure, for sure. Where'd you meet your husband at? Uh, I met him on Facebook, actually. Really? Yep, in 2015. And I didn't become his friend until 2016. And my first question was, are you a scammer? <laughs> <laughs> and he was like, you are so rude. I just thought your eyes would be... Skin can really cling. To the back of the nail. Sometimes people will say it just clings more to the underside of the nail. So what was the hardest part about starting your business? My salon business or the YouTube business? I guess both. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to visit my channel. People like you are the reason for my success and I appreciate it so much. But remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for all the latest videos. Remember it is free and I'll see you next time.